Welcome to today's 5 minute FreeQMS video, where you'll be fully trained on a module of your choosing. Today we will be focusing on the last of the currently available modules, the Nonconformance module. Naturally we'll start by logging in with your assigned credentials. Once signed in you'll be directed to the FreeQMS homepage, listing all the available modules. From here you can click the red Nonconformance module icon to continue. The Nonconformance module is free and available to all companies from the beginning. Once you navigate to the Nonconformance module, you'll be taken to the module directory, which will list out all records in the appropriate module. If you click Create Nonconformance at the top of the page, you'll be taken to a blank nonconformance form. You can complete this form by filling out the mandatory fields marked by an asterisk. The mandatory fields are Title, Coordinator, which is populated from a collection of user account data from your FreeQMS instance, and Nonconformance status. Once you've at least filled out these fields, you can click the Create button at the bottom of the form. Once completed, you can access this nonconformance from the module's directory page. Click on it to reopen the nonconformance. At the top, you'll see several tabs that offer various options to you, such as nonconformance activities, including containment, investigation and root cause, notify external party, verification of effectiveness, and correction and rework. There's also the Files tab, where you will upload all relevant documentation as well as Tasks, where you can assign tasks to other users, and finally the Approvals tab, where you can start approval cycles. And that about covers it. You're ready to handle nonconformances. Be sure to subscribe to the channel so as to not miss any future tutorials and news on upcoming changes and additions to FreeQMS.